What's up, y'all? This is Brother Ali, and um, I'm actually really excited right now. I came by the Rhyme Shares office, and my man Jake One's CDs just came in. This is White Van Music, and um, me and Jake have known each other since probably like 2001, something like that. Before I started working on Shadows on the Sun, um, Jake came out here and worked, did some songs with me and Musab. Jake is out of Seattle, and um, him and Vitamin D came out here and we did some jams together. And um, they didn't really turn out, like we didn't really have um, enough time to really sit and work together. Um, but this album, man, since then, you, you guys know what I did. And um, since then, Jake One has gone on to produce everything from, man, 50 Cent, like that, that single that he did with Mary J. Blige, All of Me, on the last album. And he also did Rock Cocaine Flow with Doom and on, on that De La Soul album. And everything in between, man. And like, he still works with a lot of like real underground, grimy cats, you know what I'm saying? People that, you know, they're, they're, they're doing their first stuff they do with him. And he's amazing, man, he's versatile. And the thing to me that's so fresh and the reason why I was really happy that we got this album and got to do it on Rhyme Says is because I think that a lot of the fans that we have, man, and, and God bless all of y'all eternal souls forever uh, for, the, for the way you support us and the way you ride with us. But I think of the mistake that a lot of y'all make sometimes, man, is that you think that hip hop is really segmented off and you think that because that some of you, you all think that because we're underground, that means that we hate the mainstream or any of that. All of us that come from hip hop backgrounds, we used to listen to everything. Um, hip hop, all hip hop used to be pretty underground. But I mean, we, we didn't only listen to one kind of rap. Like when we wanted to party, you know, um, we would listen to like a Heavy D. And uh, when we wanted to think and be smart and righteous, then we would listen to Public Enemy. And then when we hated our parents, we'd listen to NWA and, and, and Ghetto Boys and all that stuff. And we didn't distinguish one from the other. So to me, that's what this is about. Slug is on here, MF Doom is on here, and Young Buck and Busta Rhymes are on here. And it's all the same thing. And the thing that Jake was telling me is that uh, like the beats that Little Brother and them want are the same beats that 50 and them want, 50 Cent, you know what I'm saying? And it, it really is all the same, man. It really is all the same. Th those dudes are just a little more attractive than us, and their songs are a little more um, easy for everybody to grab onto and gravitate towards. So they get to be rich and famous, but we get to we get you, and um, and we love you, and and so we're all happy at the end of the day. So this is what you need to do on um, October the seventh. Yeah, October the seventh. Jake won White Van Music. Don't front. Don't do the bullshit. And download. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, this is this is what it's really about. This is good shit right here. Right here, I'm going to show you. I'm really excited about this, personally. This is the new MOP joint on there. Yeah.